Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode of Harry Potter Wizards Unite. Today we are doing an 8 times 10 kilometer Porky Portmanteau opening where we'll be getting some really good rewards, things that I haven't seen in the game other than from Porky's, uh, some pretty special fragments that we're going to need. They're like the, the most difficult things that, uh, that look like to be acquired things that are like 1 out of 125. We're going to be getting into that and showing them off. First of all though, before we get into that, I just want to do a massive shout out to Amino who are sponsoring this video. So what I've recently set up with Amino's help is a brand new global profile there where I've been releasing stories pretty much daily um, on updates about the game, also best bits of screenshots, some really good encounters. Porky opening, also any funny clips that I have from the day, photos I've taken with the AR shots. So you guys can go check that out. You can do that by downloading the app from your iOS or Google Play Store. Just search Amino and it will come up. Once you downloaded the app, you can go into the Communities tab, uh, I'll put it on screen there, and you can go into the search bar and just type in Go Shiny Hunter, clicking the Users tab, and my account will come up. There you will have access to all the stories that I've already created and will be putting out in the future. Another feature that I really like is the fact that I'm able to chat with some of you. So you can go to my global profile, which is, I'll also put that on the screen, how to access that. And you'll be able to just go to the chat room and there I've already been talking with you guys. And it's great for me to be able to just kind of chat on the go with you guys. And also you can share your screenshots and videos with me. So the story that I'll be putting up today is going to be on just a top five tips, just some things that will be really useful in the game if you don't know them already. And I'll be putting more videos out like this. So here's a sneak preview of what I'm going to be putting out today. Ruffio's Brain Elixir is going to be one of the potions that you use up probably the most. Rather than spend 100 coins on just one, go to the potions, rent a pot for 90 coins, and then put three Ruffio Brain Elixirs in there. And See the rest, go and download the app and join the community now. So, it's time to get into the 8 times 10 Keep Up, Keep Up Mento opening. Let's do it. Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode. Today we are going out because the time has come where we can finally do all these port keys. Every single one of them is a 10k port key. I'm going to go on a walk with Leo. I'm going to go on a walk. Ah, ah. Yeah, we're going on a walk. Got a few oddities here. So we've got some more water. These will be Erklings. Get a lot of Erklings in the daytime. Getting to a point where these, I've got full Erklings, and I know this care of magical creatures now is going to be a hippogriff because it's the only one of the it's not severe high high threat. Oh, it wasn't. <laughs> My bad is faux glass, which I actually think I need. Faux glass is in the third page. I'm not even getting any blue when I cast the spell. How much spell energy am I going to waste on these guys? How was that a bad trace? That looked like a perfect trace. And and that's the one. That's that's the one. I just need to sit down. That's all. Okay, now it's time to use these eight port keys. Uh, see what we get in 8 10Ks. Last time we got a Hermione Granger wand uh, and we've had a fanged frisbee, so it'll be interesting to see what we get from this. Let's do this. No, Skeeter's Quick Quill Notes Quill, awesome. Just realized I didn't use Burrifio's Brain Elixir and I got a ton of experience. That kind of sucks. <laughs> no, 
Follow your own tips. Use a Brookfield's brain elixir before you use all your porky openings. Right. Let's see what we get from these. Oh, got a free porky. Extendable ears. It looks like we're getting a lot of stuff for the challenges page that you don't actually get in the wild. We got our first Pensu. Yes, this is on the Mysterious Artifacts page. It's the one thing that I, I have missing on that page. So it must be you can only get them from 10Ks, maybe Fortresses as well. Nice, we've got loads of beginner's guide to transfiguration and we've got a ton of challenges rank 145. That was good, family XP for our registry. Next, we've got three left. So we've got two more to go. I don't think we've had six. I think one of them may have glitched. And we'll have to go to check what our reward was for it. Yeah, we've got a picket. Now he's for my zoology. So we've got our first picket. And one left.
and we've got a book beak for our Care of Magical Creatures page. So these are good additions to our Care of Magical Creatures page because we are going to need them once we're trying to um, once we try and prestige. In terms of XP, it looks like for sure, it doesn't matter whether you got a 2k or 5k or 10k, your chances of getting experience is the same for all of them. I don't think it's like Pokemon Go where you get more experience um, towards your level from high, more from 10k's than you do 2k's and 5k's. If we look at the new additions there, so we've got red, one new fragment for Book Beak. Um, we have, I didn't think we, we got any others other than we got Picket, didn't we, for our family registries. Rank up with that. So we see, ooh, how many, we just need some Nifflers and Billywigs there. We see Picket in Central Park. Oh, we're gonna need 11 of them. So that's like 10, 11 10Ks in, how many do you need to do to be able to get them? We did get some nice new additions to challenges though. Here's the Fanged Frisbee that I found in a previous 10K. So we've got a whole bunch of joke products that we need to get. Magical devices, I got my first Skeeter's Quick Quotes Quill. That came from a 10K. In terms of challenges, nothing. So we got Ron Weasley's wand out of one of the um, port keys. I think one of them glitched due to either network, probably this phone. <laughs> The S8 is so much harder to use in the AR than the S10. The S10 is flawless. I am just wondering, it's not very balanced in terms of if you've got to find 150 fragments. In relation to your registry, the challenges just seem like another level. Uh, but maybe these are going to be for you know like your pros getting these maxed out. Um, I think we got one book toward a beginner's guide for transfiguration, which is a pretty bad drop from a 10k if you can't get that from fortresses. Um, I think about it, no I've already prestiged that level, so you can get four easily from a fortress from that, so that wasn't the best find. Apart from that, I think it's, we've got some good finds, clearly the 10Ks have objects that you're not going to see in the wild, or at least very rarely. I haven't seen any of the challenges, the joke products in the wild, um, so I think it's going to be the only way you get from them. Let me know if you've got uh, any good, any of these objects that I've got in 5Ks or 2Ks, just so we know what's in the pool. So we can start to see a picture of what we're going to see in 10K port keys. Okay, well that's all for this one. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, please hit the like button and hit subscribe if you want to keep up to date with future content. I'll be putting out plenty more content like this and working my way up to getting a ton of port keys to open for the next episode. That's all from me. See you guys soon.